Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have 5 to the power of x equals to x to the power of 625 and we solve this problem for the values of x. So here uh, in order to find the value of x here we need to move the variable terms in the right hand side and we move the constant terms in the left hand side. So that in order to move this x to the right hand side, we need to take the x root on both of the sides. So that here we will take 1 over x power on both of the sides. Uh, so it will be written as 5 to the power of x and its whole power is 1 over x equals to x to the power of 625 and its whole power is 1 over x. So here uh, we need to apply the nice exponent law. So according to this law, if you have a to the power of m to the power of n, it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n. So according to this exponent law, we need to multiply these two exponents and these two exponents as well. Um, so that when we multiply the exponents, it will be written as 5 to the power of x multiplied by 1 over x equals to x to the power of 625 multiplied by 1 over x. So here we need some simplification. This x is cancelled out by this x and we have our 5 is equals to here we move this 1 over x inside the term and it will be written as x to the power of 1 over x and its whole exponent is 625. So here you see that uh, we move the variable terms in the right hand side and now we have the time to move the uh, constant terms in the left hand side. So that here we need to move the 625 in the left hand side. For this we need to take the 625th root on both of the sides. It, it means that we will apply, uh, we will take uh, 1 over 625 power on both of the sides. So it will be written as um, x to the power of 1 over x and its whole power is 625 and its whole power is 1 over 625 and now you see here we have gain exponent to the exponent uh, so we write it as this is 5 to the power of 1 over 625 equals to here these exponents are multiplied by each other so this 625 is cancelled out by this 100 this is 625 we get the remaining terms are x to the power of 1 over x and now here in the next step uh, you see that we have uh, this is the base and this exponent is 1 over x so we need uh, to make uh, these base and exponent are, so, are same uh, likewise this term uh, so that in order to make uh, the base and its exponent are this base and its exponent be the reciprocal of its base. So for this we need to take the uh, we need to multiply and divide the exponent of this term by 5. So we write it as 6 to the power of 5 divided by 5 and it is multiplied by 1 over 625 uh, and we have this is equal to x to the power of 1 over x. So further in the next step we need more simplifications and it will be written as uh, here we uh, we move this 5 inside the term and we multiply this 5 with this 6 and this 625 so it will be written as 5 to the power of 5 and its exponent is 1 over 5 multiplied by 625 and this is equals to x to the power of 1 over x. So here we need to multiply this 5 with this 625 so it will be written as uh, and now we first multiply this term here so we have this is 5 we will multiply it here 5 times of 625 equals to this is 5 times of 5 is 25 we write 5 and carry 2 5 2 is a 10 10 plus 2 is 12 we write 2 and carry 1 5 6 is a 30 30 plus 1 becomes uh, 30,125. Similarly, uh, this 5 to the power of 5 means that we need to multiply this 5 with the 5 times. So, this is 5 times of 5 is 25. 25 times of time is 125. 125 times of 5 becomes 625. 625 becomes here 3,125. It means that 
if we multiply 5 with 5 times we will again get here 3125 so now we have uh, the time to uh, replace 5 to the power of 5 and uh, 5 times of 5 equals 5 times of 625 equals to 3125 okay uh, so that uh, we move backward to uh, this equation so here when we substitute uh, these values it will be written as so 5 to the power of 5 equals to 3125 to the power of 1 over 3125 equals to x to the power of 1 over x so now you see here uh, the basis uh, uh, if you have this base and its exponent be the reciprocal of the base so uh, according to the exponent law uh, we if you compare both of the sides uh, when you compare the basis then you get the value of x equals to 3125 and when you compare the exponents then you get uh, uh, 1 over x equals to 1 over 3125 so from both of these cases we will get the uh, final value of x is 3125 so this is the final answer of this question and now here we need to verify this value of x uh, so for verification of the value we need to copy down the given question statement so the given question statement is 5 to the power of x equals to x to the power of 625 so now we need to uh, put the value of x on both of the sides and we check the behavior so we have 5 to the power of x is 3125 equals to this is uh, x to the power of uh, uh, 625 so we again put it here 3125 to the power of 625 so here we need to focus in the left hand side and uh, here uh, we rewrite this term as this is 5 to the power of 3125 and we write this term as 5 multiplied by 625 so 5 times of 625 equals to 3125 it is equals to 3125 to the power of 625 so here we move this 5 inside the term uh, so it will be written as 5 to the power of 5 and its whole power is 625 equals to 3125 to the power of 625 so here you see that uh, 5 to the power of 5 is equals to uh, 3125 to the power of 625 equals to 3125 to the power of 625. So this shows that the value of x satisfied the given question statement. This is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.